seem to have, like, the, the, the world team years here, you can't do it, but the Olympic year every time. <laughs> what's up with that? I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. It's not, I don't know if that's, like, what I would recommend. I don't know if that's, like, the easiest route. But for some reason, like, I'm just wired in such a way that, man, I get, I just have these tough outcomes, and I'm just better for it. I don't know why it's like that. Coming into this tournament, you certainly had a lot of people that believed in you, but you also had a lot of people who didn't think you could do it. What's it feel like to silence your critics? Um, you just, I don't, I don't know, I don't know if I focus on that. I mean, I put enough pressure on myself, I don't need to look elsewhere to find pressure. I knew that I had a very small, tight circle of people that believed in me. Like, unquestionable. They just believed without a doubt. My training partners, my coaches, my nutritionists, my sports psychologists. Just a close-knit group of people. And that's what I needed. And, you know, just believing and having faith. And, and why do you gotta look elsewhere? Like, some people are motivated differently. I just have to focus on what's in front of me. And that was a big thing. I mean, I would say the last couple months I've just been trying to make the most of every day. And people are asking me, are you excited for trials? I'm like, you know, I'm just excited for dinner tonight. Like, I'm just excited for, like, the next thing. And so that's... I don't know, like I definitely, but again to answer your question, <laughs> thank you. I definitely don't look elsewhere to put pressure on myself, I don't need to, I put enough on myself, so. Let's talk match, um, it's, I don't know, within the last 30 seconds you're on the shot clock, she's about to get the point and like, it was like at 30 seconds or 31 you get that push up, were you aware of how close it was to being expired, the shot clock? I, um, I didn't know, I knew that the match was almost over. So I was a little surprised that he put me on the clock again, but I mean, have you seen my last few matches? Like, it's just kind of like that with me lately, like, um, just kind of under the gun. So I, I really wasn't aware. I think you, you train those situations a lot to score quick. Um, and you know, like if you've ever been the in the room with Zeke Jones, he's all urgency, everything, be urgent. And so like, it may not seem like it, you have to be patient to score, but when the time comes to score, I felt like I was ready because I've been put in those situations in training. So um, I didn't really look at the clock. I knew that the match was almost over, so I knew how to score anyways. So. <laughs> I've been to Mongolia. Yeah, once I won there. So that, so I mean, it's, it's different. Like it's gonna be. Everyone's trying to, to get their country qualified. I didn't even think past this tournament, though. I wasn't thinking about Mongolia. Like, how could I? I have to make the team first. I have to win every match. Like, so you know, that's coming. That's the next thing. Um, but really. Uh, I feel like if you can win Olympic trials in the U.S., you can win anything. So. Congratulations, <laughs> Thank Kelsey. Thank you. Best of luck. Thanks, Kelsey. What was your reaction?